Transporting your cat using fear-free guidelines, part one, going to the vets. Does your cat like going to the vets? Is it stressful taking your cat in the car? Is your cat exhibiting signs of stress even before reaching the vets? Today, I'm going to give you some tips to reduce fear, stress, and anxiety when transporting your cat from your house to your vets. Effective preparation is one of the keys to a successful visit. You may wish to consider to let your vet know your cat's requirements. Planning improves you and your pet's experiences. Maybe it needs to be a quiet time. Maybe it does not like other cats, but okay with dogs and vice versa. Knowing this potentially allows the right timing to book, to book your cat that may be more prone to fear, anxiety and stress. Certainly bringing your pet's favourite treat or toy may help to reduce stress. Perhaps it may be useful to keep them hungry, so the treats you brought may work better, unless there are medical reasons not to do so. Each cat is an individual, and every scenario different. When the time for the visit comes, ideally you have acclimatised your cat to its carrier. Then you can easily lure the cat into the carrier Close the door and be ready to transport your cat to the vets. Be sure to keep a comfy bedding, familiar scents and pheromones with the carrier and cover it with a towel for transport. Treats and catnip may make the trip better for some cats. If you want to find out more about how to choose a carrier and how to get your cat a better use to your carrier, be sure to watch our other video that states just that cats and their carriers. Only transport two cats together if they're comfortable, but beware that while they may be comfortable on the way to the vets, on the return trip, anxiety may spike and result in fighting. When using a carrier to transport your cat, please do not pull your cat out from a hiding place to put them into the carrier. This will likely increase fear, anxiety and stress. Getting a car ready for your pet for transport is often overlooked. You may want to include playing quiet, calm or familiar music, avoid loud startling noises and provide pheromones. Towers can help block visual stimuli and a non-slip mat or towel inside the carrier will minimize slipping and increase comfort which will all reduce fear, anxiety and stress. Your cat should be safely restrained to ensure the safety of him and your safety. If unrestrained, it may cause car accidents, get lost in an event of car accident, be thrown about, thrown around during sudden stops, or slip onto the seat and become stressed. You can secure them in a carrier or a crate on the floor behind the passenger seat to ensure not only their safety, but also your safety. If you're using a crate in a boot, Please remember to secure it so that they will not move in an event of an accident or a sudden stop. How do we carry the carrier from the house to the car and from the car to the reception area? Very, very carefully. My advice is do not use the handle on the carrier when the cat is inside. Do not transport the carrier like a suitcase when your cat is inside because the motion may upset the cat. And when it enters the waiting area, it may be the eye level of dogs already there. Once the cat is inside the carrier, carry it like a very fragile gift, a precious gift, like your cat is, close to the chest and held with both hands. Cats also can become fearful when restrained in cars despite our best efforts to make it a positive experience. Before transporting your cat, please check her body language be sure that it is as relaxed and as possible. And also to monitor your kitty cat to make sure it is not panting, vocalizing, attempting to escape, or urinating or defecating in the carrier. If you're not sure or concerned that your cat may be showing signs of fear, anxiety, and or stress, please do call your vet 
and further advice may be given. I hope this has given you some useful tips for bringing your cat to the vet. Don't forget to watch the second part on tips of transporting your cat home stress-free from the vet. Comment below your take-home message from this. I look forward to see you at the next live event. This is Amity.